Hello and welcome to First Value. My name is Munez Shoka. I'm the editor of Capital Recruitment News. With me today is Rashid Winishi. Rashid is the director of distribution for Africa and Middle East. Rashid, um, today you are celebrating 70 years of coming South Africa. Just how strategic is coming South Africa to come in business? Come South Africa is uh, the most strategic business we have in uh, this, the growth story for uh, Cummins in Africa. Uh, we've been here 70 years, but we've only started investing seriously in the rest of Africa for the last five or six years. And our anchor business in Africa is in South Africa. Um, and that serves uh, to propel our business and, and it allowed us to grow at a faster pace um, in different places in Africa because of the people, the capabilities that we built here over the last 70 years. That allow, it allowed us to move a lot faster uh, into other territories, into other countries even on the continent. Um, so so uh, this is a very significant and important and strategic business for us. Um, in addition to that, the market is one of our largest markets as well. Market size is, is very, very significant when we compare it to most other countries on the continent. <laughs> you also recently took a decision to merge your Middle East and Africa businesses. Why that decision? Well, it, it allows us two things. One is uh, we can leverage capabilities that we have in Africa and, and bring them into the Middle East and, and vice versa. Yeah. We also have some capabilities in the Middle East that we can use to grow more in, in Africa. I think that's uh, one of the reasons. That the other reason is by combining the two businesses, um, we gain scale. We gain, um, so we become much larger. We have a lot more employees that we can uh, leverage uh, their capabilities in, uh, across the larger region, Africa and the Middle East. Mm -hmm. um, but we also, the more when we invest in, in this larger um, uh, area now, we are able to um, gain a return on investment much faster than mm -hmm. when we're two small regions. Yeah. Okay. So uh, those are some of the benefits, um, and there are many, many others uh, combining the two regions. What sort of opportunities do you see in Africa moving forward? Obviously, South, Southern Africa is battered by the money sector, which is currently in dire straits. Where yeah. else do you see opportunity moving forward? Well, we, we have, um, Mining is one uh, segment in, in, or one market that we, we've been playing in for many, many years, but there are many, many other markets. So our story, um, or our growth story in the future, will uh, rely more on diversification. Okay. Okay. So we plan to diversify, um, and we are already diversifying in many, many markets. So we're in power generation, we're in the bus market, we're in the truck market, we're in the construction segment. Uh, we're in the marine segment, we're in the oil and gas segment. These are all present and thriving in many, many places in, in Africa. And um, our engines are um, already in a lot of equipment in these markets and in these segments. And the plan is for us to now to know, focus more uh, mm -hmm. on those segments. Uh, not that we are going to uh, forget about mining, of course will always be present in mining. And once that market starts uh, recovering, we will be there uh, with uh, a very uh, strong presence. Thank you very much, Rashid, for your time. We really appreciate it. Thank you.